Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be making a smoothie with you guys. It is currently 9.30 a.m. where I'm at right now. And so I'm going to show you a very simple smoothie that I make in the morning. And yeah, hope you guys like it. Okay, so first thing first, I'm going to add two very ripe bananas. The first thing you always want to add to your smoothie is the soft stuff and then add the hard and frozen stuff on the top. If you guys are wondering what I mean by ripe, this is what I mean by ripe. I like my bananas um, pretty spotted and pretty brown because then they are a lot sweeter. Okay, so next I'm going to be adding quite a bit of wild blueberries. These ones are Canadian. And I'm just using the President's Choice brand, but it doesn't really matter. I love blueberries. Okay, next I'm going to add some of my favorite fruits or my favorite berries. Raspberries. I love a lot of frozen fruit in mine because I like a more thicker consistency smoothie. Okay, next I'm going to add some of these ground chia seeds. Um, the, this is going to be optional. Sometimes I literally just do fruit, no extra whatever, but I'm feeling like some chia seeds this morning, so I'm just going to add a little sprinkle in here. Okay, more than a little sprinkle. I love chia seeds. This next step is also optional. I really love flax seeds too, and flax is really good. So I'm gonna add a little bit of this. Again, these last two steps are totally optional. You don't have to do them. This smoothie will work totally fine with just a fruit in it and then a little bit of liquid. So normally I will just put like a little tiny splash of water in here just to get the um, right consistency that I like. But I do have this apple juice today, no sugar added, and I'm going to just put a little bit of that into my smoothie just so that it blends a little bit easier and it's that consistency that I like. I think that's enough. Again, you can always add more. I always start with less and then you can always add more liquid if it's not blending the way you want it to. I'm using the Ninja Blender today. I really love this blender. I got it for free from a company um, that I was promoting for and they gave me a free blender with all the attachments and I totally love this blender. All right, now it's time for blending. I'm going to start with the low settings and then turn it up. Okay, next you just want to pour it into a cup or a jar of your choice. Mine is a super thick consistency as you can see, just like I like. I don't know why I find it so satisfying to pour, watch my smoothie pour into my cup. So as you guys might be able to see here, I like my smoothie a very, very thick consistency not watery at all. It's kind of a mix between an ice cream and a smoothie consistency. I hope you guys like 